Hello there. Hello there. Oh, well, you can hear me as well, because I forgot to fucking mute the stream I'm looking at. There we go. There we go. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the shit show. That is my streams. Are we going to crash? Most likely. F -f Fuck it, you know? We can have fun. <laughs> Joining me today, so far, is Anthony. Arf! Fuck it! And he's coming off a win, so he's happy. Fed up with freak! <laughs> He has indeed won. Anyways, that's yes, goodbye. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. How are you today? Doing fine? Hope so. Pray so. Good. Uh, before we start today, fair warning. You're going to hear a lot of background noise because I am joined by two doggos. So, uh, yeah, there's that. One is an old fuck who will just sleep and try to get my attention. The other guy is quite noisy. So, um, yeah, enjoy that. Anyways, that's not what we're here today. We're not here for a doggo review. We are here for... Fucking come and hurry up, you fucking... There it is. It is the Southern Railway's new L1 class. Or as I like to call it, the unrebuilt 2P. From the Midland Railway. Yes. <laughs> that's what it looks like. It does. It like literally like the only difference like from a distance you can see from like between these and the Fowler two P's is the cab. More specifically the extra window in the cab. Yeah. Pretty much. Also I think the smoke box store is a little bit faster than on the um on the two P. <laughs> Basically we think there is an Ed and Skit uh, Ed and Sid Skit etching back. I really, I really hope it's one where they go to an alternate universe and they just show up and they're this and they're like, what the fuck? Well, if they were summons, like, you have to have Sid be this, but damn it, we'd need a Cubo. Well, a Q class, and we don't have one. Ah, make him a 700, who cares? But yes, so, this is what we're looking at today. It's a 440, uh, allegedly one of the most successful locomotives from the Southern, which sells a lot. Um, <coughs> sorry, did I say that out loud? Uh, anyways, before I get shot by the purists, uh, this is a very nice looking Locos. Very, very nice, very nice. It's got a nice tender that I don't think we have in game yet. Like, this is the first time we see it in game. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, we got the cab as per usual. You can see over here we have Bible and Pipe, Chris's trademark thing which makes me happy every time I see it and you got this weird thing over here which I'm guessing is a steam reverser which I have no fucking clue how to operate but we'll figure it out GT forwards I don't get it Grand Theft forwards no I was more thinking Grand Tour as in Dragon Ball Jet Grand Tour anyways yeah But yes, this is what we're looking at today. And as you can see, this there's... Ah, 786, as shown by the buffer beam. Yes. So we're going to be looking at this locomotive today. Now, I have noticed something. I might be wrong here. I don't think... And I mean this in the nicest way possible. I don't think my TS is sound. <laughs> Well, what someone did, someone just noticed it. Uh, yeah, um, the Empire's invaded. Uh, just ignore them. Jedi, Sith business, go back to your drinks. Um, <laughs> hang on. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll check over at the, uh, when we're driving today. We might have to restart the game. You never know. You know, it's 50-50. But this is the one we're driving today. The Bullied Malachite, I believe it is. So please have sound. We're golden! <laughs> In other words, yes, we do have sounds. I'm confused what you're asking, Joel Rock, but... 
I'm presuming you're asking why I have two different ones. Well, it's simply because this one is a different green than the other one, and I like this one more. Oh, God. Oh, no, Chris, you haven't. Oh, Chris, you haven't. Oh, I hate you. What? Oh, I'm going to hate driving this thing. <laughs> oh, dear, what's he done? Right, so... I want you to pay close attention to my reverser, right, Anthony? Oh, let me guess, because it is actually steam-operated, you can't control it properly. Yeah, I'm going to have to use the F5 HUD. <sighs> Which isn't a problem! Of course, come on, man! <laughs> Make it toggleable at least, please! I hate this kind of driving. Oh, god damn it. Okay, fine. Well, whatever. 2.0, here we come. Is that a van in the train? Yes, it's a luggage van. The problem is, every time you mention 2.0, Guion kills a couple of children. Oh, god. Well, oh, it's just black motor! Oh, we was supposed to say baby on board. Oh, well. Tough shit. Why, Chris, are you pregnant? Yeah, I wasn't gonna say. Chris, have you cheated on me again? <laughs> so, before we go any deeper into that plot hole, let's, uh... <laughs> oh my god, oh, we're so fucked. Okay. Well, shit. I wasn't expecting to have to learn how to drive this thing... <sighs> ...by feeling. Uh, how was it? How did I turn on automatic firing again? I don't know, does the Chris's engines have also firemans? Yes. Since when? Hey, since like f five releases ago? I was not consulted on this. Then again, I haven't bought any of Chris's products in ages. So. What? <laughs> Fair well, enough. I'm pretty sure the last thing I bought from Chris was it was like the, the wanky um, stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, figures. <laughs> Gee, I wonder why you bought the lanky stuff. <laughs> you'd almost think. Yeah, you'd think I was from Wales. You fucking what? No. Uh, control R. Might be. Thank you. My fellow Norwegian. <sighs> okay, well... Ladies and gentlemen, you're about to watch me suck at driving, so uh, strap yourselves in and enjoy the shit show. This is gonna suck. Alright. Well, no point like. English. No time like the present. Let's go. Mr. Bexby. It is a good looking engine though, I will give it that. Service person service three. No the fuck it isn't. Also I had to reduce the amount of coaches because Ben yelled at me for having the wrong concept with uh bird cages. And we're going to also do shift P so that we get some more frames. Fucking hell, she's taking off. Didn't even have time to say hello to Buck today. Be flying. Oh, hello, Mr. Um, Mr. Cuckleberry. Cuckleberry's right there. What'd you do this time? I do the fucky wucky. <laughs> Sorry, I do the fucky wucky. No time like the present. Yeah, me, me, me fucking too. You bet I'll derail by points. Well, you know what? Just because you said that, let's go through the entire route, which I've already done mostly. But let's go up here. Let's see. Points are good here. Points are good here. 
Well, you know what? Because you said that, we're going to derail a different way. We're going to crash into the buffers. <laughs> Have some faith in me. The driver tried to apply the brakes, but the L1 was going too fast. Bang! <laughs> I mean, I am, I am doing 50. Which is not bad. So, not Sid is puffing along in the line. Yes, not Sid. Now, let me just text someone to let them know they shouldn't scream when they come inside. There we go. All right. Okay. There we go. So, how is everyone today then? I hope you're all doing fine. If you got any issues, please take it up with the staff in the back, which is Anthony. I didn't sign up to this. I was kidnapped. <laughs> we know. That usage rate just shot up. Holy shit. <laughs> but we got plenty of pressure, so it should be fine. Doing a nice 60 mile an hour in 0 for 0. No, 4 for 0 even. Can't complain. <laughs> You're just watching. <laughs> Look, okay? We're not doing a derail buffer bash, okay? I appreciate the moated popcorn, but we're not doing a derailment. <laughs> I beg. Why must Pokemon Emerald be so difficult? It isn't. Emerald's one of the easier ones. Doesn't even look fa fast when there's no valve visible. I don't know. It's still like if I go over here because we're running with it now. But if I go over here, and we look at it coming past, how many crashes? Zero so far. It's got some decent speed to it. Let's see how it handles the hills. At least trying to get over them. For anyone who did not know when I what I said there, you're too young for YouTube. <laughs> Can you do a V4? I mean, if Chris makes one, then yeah, probably. But the old ones, I don't really see any point reviewing old locos. Unless you want to do a fucking driving and reminiscing. But then again, the V4 isn't really my cup of tea. Almost as fast as Buck when he's a female. Nah. Trust me. Buck will go fast, regardless of what he sees. <laughs> Depending on his mood, of course. Hello there. You don't need to spam high, by the way. You keep spamming high, and I'm gonna time you out. So, uh, we're, we're good, fam. We're good. What the fuck is that in the distance? Hang on. Suddenly, Chris realized he'd accidentally loaded up episode 10 scenario. No, 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 no. Connor, you're literally watching. What do you mean, how I crashed yet? Hang on, what the fuck is that over there? Oh. Oh. Hello. Huh. 
<sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is with sad news that I have to inform you that, first of all, the rebellion has appeared. Um, secondly, your host Chris is uh, about to uh, die. What is that? That's a fucking X-Wing. But yes, uh, I'm about to die because uh, one of these fuckers, dogs, have um, let off what can only be called a chemical warfare detonation. So, uh, yeah, I'm about to choke. So, uh, it's been nice meeting you all. wasn't a bad stop. I call that decent. Say goodbye to my nose? Yeah, I've shut it off. <sighs> Literally turned it off. Yes, um, I got a gift today. <laughs> Look, it's R2. <laughs> that explains that. <laughs> oh, I love getting new assets. But yeah, so far, I must say I'm impressed with this thing. Being a 4 for all, I wouldn't expect it to, you know, put down the punch this bad. The other dog just had to leave due to the smell. Or because I'm on a ride. Even better. Oh, thank God, the dogs are gone. We're lucky. <laughs> right. So now, we shall remove the brakes, and we shall head up further towards the end of the line. Yeah, and there goes the screaming. <laughs> right, well, let's get a move on, shall we? background that's my cousin <laughs> wait there's cab views on the fucking van oh no oh my god <laughs> okay can we um oh yeah, I did not mean for that to happen. That was a that was a colossal fuck up on my part. Huh. <laughs> Which livery is your favorite livery? Uh, it depends. Are we talking about livery in in this pack, or are we talking like ever? <laughs> Luke is going for it. <laughs> <laughs> no, because if it's, um, oops. Yeah, for the, for the pack, I would say it's a tie-up between the bullied Malachite or the worn BR line black, because I'm a sucker for line black. Um, I will say, though, I, I did really like the, um, is it Ashford? The Ashford Olive, the one I showed at the start. Fucking hell, this thing takes off. And of course, gotta do our customary whistle to the signalman. Fucking young knuckles. And then we approach the tunnel, which has Rest in peace to you, because you don't exist anymore. And you, because you got an updated design. Mm. 
gorgeous. But yes, for the pack, I definitely say either this or lime black, which um, you know, you'll see it. You'll see it later. The lime black. Yes, R.I.P. Peanut. He didn't get killed or anything, but the design had to be changed because of legal reasons. Are we looking for speed? We're slowly decreasing. That's nah, fine. Should be fine. I do really enjoy this auto fireman though. It makes it so much easier to do like driving reviews where I don't have to constantly fire the fucker. <laughs> well, yeah, it's it's a shame because you know everyone knows that as peanut, but the artist or the the sculptist did say. You can use it as so long as it doesn't get used for like merch and stuff and you know, it ended up being, so what can you do? I don't think this thing will stall. It's actually pretty pretty decent. And then on the seventh day the train went wee. So this is the steepest hill I have on my railway. And that's a dog. 153. Let's see, if we, let's see how fast we go when we get up it. Also, I updated the train a bit here because, you know, it looked a bit dull. Still need to open it up a bit, but, you know, it's getting there. Shit, 80 miles per hour. Well, we'll see how we do on the return journey, because that's all downhill. Is there shift B missile? Control B. Control space. Control space. I swear it's like they put which button to use through like a random wheel, and then it's like, eh, we'll use this one. What's the top speed of this loco? Uh, well, you know, I don't know, but I can always do uh, S R L one top speed. Well, I see nothing, so shit out of luck. Unless I do this. Nope, nothing on... Nothing on Wikipedia. No, oh, you're shit out of luck. I don't know. Shit, we made it up that hill pretty easily. Not bad, not bad. The thing is, it's matching the speed limit of the railway, like... Super easily. Who knows, who knows? Good morning, sir. How are you today? Also, is it just me, or does the sound sometimes cut out and then kick in again? Probably did a regular 75 miles per hour, fair enough. Could notch back to reverse for a bit to be fair. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get this bitch moving! On the Eastern Mainland with the Pullman Contest, fair enough. Thing is, I'd love to start doing reviews on other routes, but I just feel it's fair to do the review on the same route over and over. So I, it's like I can drive my route. I'd say perfectly, not always perfectly, but I can drive my route. So I think it's a fair test for all engines I have if I drive on the same route. Let's push this thing a little bit, shall we? 
We got pressure. Not bad, not bad. You know, not to throw shade or anything, but it's funny, this thing is doing almost as good as the original cathedral during testing. <laughs> and that's, uh, that's luckily we upgraded that so now it drives a hell of a lot better, but still. It's a good runner. I like it. Fuck, you know. See that train thunder by like it's been thunderstruck. So, what about you guys then? Do you guys have the uh, L1? What are you guys thinking of the uh, the engine so far then? It's an engine. Holy shit! But does it go chuff? No, actually, it goes. <laughs> Fuck. Wee. I tend to buy the L1. I do like me some four furrows. Four furrows are nice. I, I know some people, <coughs> Joel, <coughs> who don't like four furrows. But they're just inherently wrong. Please tell me I set the points. Yes, I did. Thank God I didn't want to have to cough up $200. There, there, and that's good, that's good. Points are set here to go in there. Good to go. Hold on, Chris, go back to the, um... Never mind. <laughs> We're good. Wait, I mean, uh, go back along to, um... That's all... Oh, uh, never mind. Are you talking about the junction? Because that's yeah. all fine. I checked. There's Not no way there, I looked it up. Not there, but, um... Cover up. Okay, yeah, you're good. It's doing that you're thing again. The scout sound stopped. Around 55 miles an hour, it stops making noise. Oh, apparently it, th that is a bug. With it. Apparently it's um, being fixed. Oh, fair enough. As long as it's being fixed. No, you said if he specifically derails on the points, he owes you 200 quid. Or did he? No idea. It is slowing down, but, you know, it's an uphill. Because I'm not giving it enough power. You know, you got to love the screaming in the background.
Man, this thing is really is slowing down on this uphill. What did I set this grain into again? One in one forty. What the fuck have you made? Ah, it's not running, is it? Wait, what? Yo, hold up, guys. Gu um, guys. The uh -huh. auto fireman is on, and I've ran out of water. Whoops. Oh, hang on, and is it one of those things where even if the auto fireman's on, you start to handle the water? Well, uh, I have not got a single clue about that. However, what I do know is that if I manage to sneak my way over here, do that, do this, Well, it's not a derailment, so you still don't owe him anything. True, and besides... I have full water, so I don't know what people are talking about. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering too. How'd that happen when I have the auto fireman on? Yeah, it's on. Can I still lose more water when I use the auto fireman if I push it too hard? Because I thought it was a case of when the auto fireman is running, you'd... Hmm. Quantum physics. Well, you know, you put quantum in front of everything, everything sounds more complicated than this. Did you pay the fireman? Well, I told him that if he wanted, if he wanted to see his wife and kids ever again, he'd have to fucking shovel. But you know, that clearly, there wasn't enough motivation. So, because you now, now we're powering up the hill. I was like, why am I losing speed on an uphill that's like nearly flat? What the hell? And then I was like, oh, oh, well, hang on a minute. <laughs> That ground needs to be bumped down. Good to know, good to know. We'll do that later. Huh. Well, that is interesting to know. Well, we're powering along now. Holy shit. Probably shouldn't, though, seeing as I'm about to, you know, reach the final destination. Wait, what did you just do? Me? Yeah, like, how are you moving again? <laughs> that, my friend, is a secret only known to a certain few intellectuals. Totally didn't fly ahead and manage to click on the engines in the sheds and then fly back and click on this one again. What, so that's now resets it, or...? Yeah. Refills the boiler, refills the tanks. Well then. Train Simulator 101, baby. <laughs> How am I moving again? Well, you'd think because of my crippling back injury. <laughs> no, that's fucked. But I do have a back injury, so it's not that fucked. Alright, well, I think... I think the engine's done fairly well. Except for the auto farm and cucking me over. Hmm. Still find that weird. You know, what are you going to do about it?
Also, I tell you, the fact that I have 100 mile an hour speed limits coming into Redwick Station, oh, that fucks with filming. Because they speed up in the platform. <laughs> I did not cause confusion in the delay. If anything, I solved it without any issue. And brakes before we hit the buffers. Oh, that sparks. Oh, yes, slip my beauty. Ignore the yelling in the background. And we made it. Ladies and gentlemen, we made it without derailing. Up. We made it up without derailing. And freeze! Fuck off! <laughs> What, 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 I'm not you. I can drive a train without crashing, dude. Rip. <laughs> Fucking piece of banana. How's the, the is, You can't bring your train. Um, you can't get your engine off the train into the shed. Oh no, that's not an issue. And click. <laughs> Sir. Oh, it's a it's a wedgie. Yes. Hey, Reese, you want to see something cool? <laughs> uh, I love you, Has Ben made you that? Or? Ben has made me that and sent it to me, and I will kiss him. <laughs> That's cheating. Good. Oh, for what the shit? <laughs> hey, Han! What? Why do they call them TIE Fighters? No idea. Gone through the TIE! Ah, uh, Family Guy. The only place See, we... That first one was funny, but then they just legit... I mean, you couldn't give a fuck for the others. Yeah, I don't know, but when uh, you do a lightsaber duel and you let a car pass, you kind of... You kind of kill the joke, man. That's not a TIE fight, that's a TIE Interceptor, so... TIE Fighter is the one you saw earlier. Yes, I'm a Star Wars nerd. Yeah, I'm totally not gonna have, like, them in the background. Oh, you should do that for shits and giggles, like it's an April Fool's one day. British Railways are organizing their final plan. Oh my god. Like, what are they up to? <laughs> Trust me, I have an April Fool's thing planned, I just need to actually make it. Really, Clark? The book out of action was severely lacking in tractive effort. <laughs> the VR standard TIE Fighter, oh my god. I'm gonna have to ask Ben if he can put an early crest on it. <laughs> He's probably gonna shoot before it, but that's a good idea. I'll have to give you royalties for that one, Reese. How about I give you a hug at Sabaton? The invasion of Thailand. <laughs> well, at least it's not Ukraine. Too soon? Too soon. Anyways. Hello, Reggie. And your beautiful ultramarine guys. Also, hello, Axel. No Levi, though. Shame. Yeah, you should be fine. Once you've had it once, you can have it again. But still, just, you know, don't be a dumbass about it. <laughs> Let's see, did I click G once too many there? Come on, come on, come on. We'll say I nailed that just for banter. Oh, for what the shit? Don't mean to steal your phrase there, Reese, but that was a for what the shit moment. Oh, come on! Thank you! Fucking hell. Why can't you spell stuff? Because, um. Uh, because Google Translate is a bit of a bitch. 
Oh, so I fucking hate the reverser on this thing. I want to die. <laughs> I, I love everything about this loco, except for the reverser, because it's such a pain. I like driving F4 HUD. Why? Why must you curse me like this? <sighs> I'm totally not tired or anything. You don't know what you're talking about. You're good. You didn't miss much. Just me not crashing. <laughs> Skills. Did check the points, right? No! Oh my God! I think I just saved it. Woo! 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 Whoops! <laughs> you saw that, right? <laughs> yes. Fuck <laughs> it out. You know what? I need a drink after that. Fuck you know. <laughs> Fuck you know, man. That was uh, way too close. That was. That is what I would like to call my ultra instinct moment. It wasn't even omen. That was master ultra instinct. Holy crap. If you don't know what that is, watch Dragon Ball. <laughs> For the love of God, it's such a good anime. Super is a bit iffy, but it has some moments. Where am I going? I'm going to my coaches. So while we're uh, just driving about, he was looking. Oop! He was looking forward to the um, second episode of uh, Rails to Refuge that's coming out next Friday. And then, of course, because I'm not a dingus, from the sheds, going there, should be clear down here, yep, clear there, not fucking up today, this is good, 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 and then fuck all of you who said it's gonna happen. Because it's not. Okay, thank you. We're going into the platform here. This siding is set right. So it's not that. So we need to put that there. And we're good. And we're good to go. Goodbye, Redwick. Goodbye. This is now a speed run. My goal is 80. We'll see. Oh, so yeah, another little update. Uh, I don't have all the voice lines for it. However, <laughs> well, yeah, of course, Joel Rock. It goes both ways, you know. I'm joking, by the way, because I would never take money from any of you guys because that would make me feel bad. But yeah, um, some update as well. Um, episode... What's it called? Episode... Uh, episode 3, 
um, barring a few voice lines, um, I ha I'm missing one scene to film on uh, on episode three, and then once I get all the voice lines, I should be good to go. And Axel's blowing off. You love to see it. Uh, that should be good to go, so I can make that. Episode four. I actually started filming, but I'm gonna be needing the help of a certain Andy Stovold for episode four, and you guys will see why when the preview for that comes about. Because I'm actually gonna release a preview for episode four. Um, episode five. I've actually done all my voice lines for. I'm just waiting for Anthony specifically because he's probably going to send me about an hour of recordings. So, uh, thanks, Anthony. And then, uh, yeah, so once I get the voice lines for that, I'll get that done. Episode 5 is going to be a big one. Like, I'm talking episode 10 big. Well, one problem with that, Jeremy, is Raymond is Tom's character. I think you're talking about Clark. Will the new engine arrive in any of the episodes? Well, technically... Technically, you just have to wait until episode 3 to see a new engine. A little bit of a hint there. Technically, you'll see a lot of engines in episode 3, but some of them aren't native to the Rebecca Chilton Hills and won't be staying at the Rebecca Chilton Hills. Wink. I'm sorry, what? What have I done? You? Given yourself like an hour of lines to do. Oh, yeah, yeah um, that's, that's great, you know. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to edit through all of that and put all that together. <laughs> oh, that sneaky son of a bit. <laughs> yeah, uh, just quick fact drop. Um, Anthony's written most of episode five. <laughs> so, you know. It's probably going to be like a quality increase for episode 5 and then it's just going to drop again in episode No, that's going to be a master quality. No, it's going to be a quality decrease. No, nah, it's going to be an increase. Trust me, increase. I've read it. <laughs> now, the uh, fans are going to turn and say, Oh, this doesn't feel like the RT on corner A. Well, fuck is this? The TDRS Halloween special. <laughs> Literally, that hurt my pride. I was like, Ow, we did our best. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Nah, I had fun. I don't care. I had fun. That's the main important thing, isn't it? Speaking of lines, though, I actually got um, the last of my um, stuff for Tom um, in yesterday. Sweet. That's good to know. Episode 3, episode 4, episode 5. Shit, I need to get on with episode 6. <laughs> yeah, because episode 6 is like... I'd say about two thirds written. So I just need to do episode six. And then I need to get on with episode seven, eight, nine, and ten, which is gonna be a pain because I'm not narrating episode seven mostly. <laughs> In fact, I might write the most of the bits without narration at all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Mr. Johnson got fucked in a good way. Not in a good way, actually. In a very, very, very bad way. And the whole mention of, you know, breaking the Geneva Convention a few times, that hasn't really aged well, has it? <laughs> well, you know, what can you do? Yeah, so, you know, well, you know, hindsight 2020. 
then again, the whole Kriegs look with cattle wagons. Yeah, I have I have my fucked up moments. <laughs> but know this, whatever I do, it's not meant to offend. If anyone gets offended by it, they've taken offense from it. I've not given it. So my conscience is clear. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Pasta Fred. Sexy Bruno. <laughs> Sexy Bruno was unavailable today. Please leave a message at the beep. Did you see um <laughs> Did you see the picture of Fred I kept posting? About the fucking Pasta Fred. <laughs> yeah. I yeah, see. So like Fred was actually quite good today. Fred did well. I saw some of his passes to Ronaldo. I was impressed. Yes, oh, we're talking football. Up, Fuck off, like, guys. The one that's, uh, yeah, sorry. Um, the one that set up his first goal was um, was brilliant. Yeah. Oh, 69 miles an hour. Nice. But yeah, that first goal was... Uh, yeah, so me and Anthony have basically converted into uh, football fans as of late. Yeah. So it's sort of Andy. Basically, what um, this past couple of weeks consisted of is me and Andy raging because uh, Manchester United have been very shit until today when Ronaldo came to the rescue. <laughs> and he scored a hat trick. And we just fucking laughed. And then I cried because one of Tottenham's goals was a known goal from you know, a player I actually like badly hates. <laughs> the one that is dubbed The Tree. <laughs> yes. Maguire has been named The Tree. Uh, one of the trees. Yeah. But is the other one in Andy's eyes? <laughs> oh, good. Maguire did something productive. It became a fucking tree. <laughs> oh, oh we have to get the ball out. No, no, not him. Not him. Not him. Not him. <laughs> Fun fact: me, Andy, and me, Andy, and Anthony were sitting watching the Arsenal uh, Manchester United game. Fun fact, Anthony and Andy support Man U, I support Arsenal. It was the funniest shit. <laughs> yes, it was. I still remember though, it's like, um, every time it's like, yeah, we're fucked, we're fucked. Oh fuck, Saka's coming on, yeah, we're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> and then, meanwhile, I'm trying to fucking enforce the will of the gods by saying, oh yeah, there's no way you don't got this. Oh, you're gonna score right now, you're gonna score. And Andy's just there like, Chris, I know what you're doing! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> and then I got... Well, let's just put it bluntly, I got yelled at a lot. <laughs> and we lost, so, you know, congratulations. <coughs> Manchester United. Your new wardrobe's good job that high. <laughs> ah, we lost a whole... Wow. 17 miles an hour on that one incline. And again, we are carrying heavy coaches. Tommy Tan coaches, in fact. But still, 60 miles an hour for a 4 for 0. Is it? Why is the Children's Hospital visiting today? Children's Hospital? Yeah, you. Anyways, hello, Riley. Mm. How are you, two? Hey. You know how I am. I'm fucked. I know, but... The Why are you are... fucked? Oh, but... yeah, we're doing the the, 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 the big street. H hello. How many, how many people are watching? Uh, 20. Pumpers. So, of the legal age. Bruh. That's a bro <laughs> moment. <laughs> anyway, what? Anthony, what? Question? What? Uh, it doesn't matter. I'll see you later. <laughs> okay. The E2s are in-game. But they're aids, and not only that, but the E2s are shit in real life. <laughs> Don't at me, Riley, I swear to god. Actually, my, my, my OC is actually an E2 with Bill and Ben's face. Hey, Riley. Oh, Gerald, what? No. Not wrong! Actually, to be fair, when I was like eight, I did have an... Thomas, Thomas, I was eight. What, right. James? What do you want, James? What is it, James? Come on, James. Say what you want, James. Come on, James. Hurry up, James. Say the fucking thing, James. Come on, James. Hurry up, James. Come on. I'm a splendid red cunt. Uh, 
Well, James isn't saying anything, so. What do you mean James isn't saying anything? James isn't here. Oh, he was adding me. Okay. Well, that's him getting timed out from my Discord server. <sighs> oh, he was basically like about the issues being in game. Yes, we, yes they are, but they they not good. Yeah. No, no, no. He was adding me as in like I said, don't at me, and then he tied uh... me. The little shit thing. So Riley, one. you who have a stable job right now, what do you think of the uh, L1? Since you can totally pay for it now. Um. This doesn't really peak my it might doesn't really peak my interest enough to immediately buy it, but it does look er poggers. <laughs> and yeah, so stable job, know. but bruh. No so Riley's yeah. saving for a new computer. I am. So if you'd like yeah. to donate to Riley Cornwall, then please donate to Epic Bernastard so I can forward it to him within five years. Chris, Wait, please. another new one. Like I swear you only got <laughs> Yeah he did, uh, but he fucked yeah. it. And Anthony, this computer runs Discord at fifteen frames per second. Oh H. Yeah. Like, you think your computer's bad, Anthony, then there's Riley's computer. Well, it means you've my computer is bad, but at the moment there's just no space to put get a new one. Because oh. I actually have the money too, it's just the space. Yeah, I get that. Come on! F 79 miles an hour, and I. Arr, come on! Come on! Come on! Why? Are you trying to go 100? No, I'm trying to go 80. Poggers. Hello, Knuckles. Hello, my brother. That's cultural appropriation. Yeah. And guess what? No shed scene today, boys! Oh, oh that's not boggish. However, there is... Luke Skywalker's oh, for... currently on the offensive. For fuck's sake, I forgot you had those. It's fucking <laughs> Also, we're not stopping. I'll tell you what you need to do, actually. Um... You need to basically find a way to green screen one of those flying over the sky at some point. I could do that. Like, if you had to basically set up one of your TIE fighters, like, against, like, a bright green backdrop, so you then just screen it flying across the screen. I could do that. Do you have Flying Scotsman in game? Yeah, but the A3 is shit. <laughs> Excuse me. The L and ER, A3, Pacifics, are shit. In my well, I mean, opinion. to be fair, like, you say A3, but it is just Flying Scotsman. Well, yeah, I hate Flying Scotsman. If you if you put Salmon Trout in front of me... Well, no, I'm saying, like, like the actual model of it is just Flying Scotsman. Like, oh, yeah, games, no, the, yeah. Um, the variants of Flying Scotsman. Well, I have Tom's pack from back well, in the day. Oh, true. But, um... Yeah, uh, please, Tom's pack broke for me. Chris, please hurry along and, um... Do, do, do the new ones, please, Pogs. Yeah, Chris, if you can do the A1s, that'd be great. Because they look better than the A3s, in my opinion. They look, uh, like, they're skinnier, aren't they, the A1s? Yeah. They're more Same. elegant. Unlike Riley. Mate, fuck it. I am extra... I'm like a swan. I'm very I elegant. I, too, and yeah, extraordinarily and you, humble, said Riley. You, you know how much I love swans. So. Yeah, I've seen your videos. Oh, I'm very sorry. Not sponsored. Yeah. Autistic Adventures of Riley Quinn. Oh, Four, yes. Five, I six, seven, eight, nine. Yes! <laughs> I have Asperger's. Dot com. Oh, my burn's going away. Yeah, I burnt myself today. It wasn't, wasn't, Good wasn't job. Burgers. Well, I hit 80 miles an hour, so I'm happy. It's alright for some. Oh, by the way, to the people watching, if you have any slight interest in Star Wars, Obi Wan Kenobi trailer is fucking amazing! Alright. Yeah, just that. <laughs> I don't care about you, you fucking... Oh, I only started watching Marvel last week and now it's become my entire existence. Uh, excuse me, I've said to you that I'm gonna... I am gonna watch Star Wars at some point, so uh -huh. fuck you. But I will have to guide you through it, because you're gonna do it the whole... completely wrong way. No, I'm... right, I, I know how it goes. Four, five, six, one, two, three, seven, eight, nine. No, 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 you skip seven, eight, nine. Those ones doesn't... doesn't count. Does? I'd say you should watch like Kenobi, Mandalorian, Rebels, Clone Wars before that. I'm gonna clone these nuts. Right. Trust me, before 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 you see the worst we have to offer, at least see the best we have to offer, dude. <laughs> Who's we? Star Wars fans. We Star Wars fa made by the fans for the fans. Who's who's whose motto was that? Um. Slogan. 
Yeah, it's it's only it's only one through six of the TV shows. So that is it. <laughs> Technically, you could get away with Force Awakens and certain bits of the Last Jedi, and then just putting Rise of Skywalker away, smothering with with a pillow and keeping it there. When when you're with wife and she touched BP, the Force Awakens. Oh. And this is why you don't have a girlfriend. Coming soon. Pending. That's a <laughs> no, fuck it. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> nah, who needs women when you've got swag? You don't even have that. I have mega swag. You have mega mind. Alright. Yeah, I, I I agree, Dusty, but the thing is, there are some moments in The Rise of Skywalker I can like, but they're all Rey and Kylo scenes, and I don't mean the final scene, <laughs> because that one was just cringe kill myself. Who needs women when you've got Tomy? Bruh, I'm not even gonna appropriate that with an answer. They're just I just collect them because I'm a virgin. Alright. Yeah, we know. By the fans for the fans sounds like a slogan for only fans. That is puggers. I've only spent fifty pound on that this month. No, I'm joking. Who the fuck is fucking message mate? The oh, thing, the thing is, is Dusty, if the, if they oh I don't know, given Finn his force powers before the end of the movie, maybe it would have been cooler to have two Jedi in the forefront. James, I'm not appropriating that with an answer, you prick probably asking me to do something in my stream like always isn't he oh no he says riley the only mega you have is mega muscles in your right arm because your girlfriend is your right hand that's a that's a funny meme I'm, that is I'm, like the oldest joke since 2008 I'm, I'm laughing so hard like my my left ear is exploding with i oh, don't fucking know Chris, you can't you can't kill the stream when he gets a red wick all right i've, I've just got a red wick manifel i've just i've just, I've no, just you said red wick you said red wick oh oh okay Huggers. Well, you said Redwick, so I won't kill oh. him when I get to Redwick. Manifel, however. Uh, I've just got here. Yeah. yeah. Well, same sucks as luck. Yeah, if Finn hadn't been a pussy in episode eight, you know, things would have been All right. better. Question, question for the chat: Should Chris carry on just so I can stay for a bit longer? This is, this is come, on, come, on, come on, come on, come on, don't let me down, chat. Come on, Huggers, Twitch chat. That's not how see, the force works. They're all saying yes. There you go. See, they they love me. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Cool. I see how it is, guys. I have this effect on people. The other effect being, run away. Yeah. All right. So we stopped perfectly in time there. Talk bollocks. No, look. So I think what we're gonna do is what? don't worry about it. Just can I use you for my thumbnail tomorrow? Uh, no, no, I don't. I don't. What? <laughs> use for, use for, for my. Th what? What for? <laughs> Thumb. I'm I'm genuinely intrigued. Riley, can I use you for my thumbnail tomorrow? <laughs> oh god, I don't mean to laugh at you, or do I? Model trains. Uh, I'm gonna say no. Uh, for the sole reason that I'm too expensive, um, and you'd be in ten thousand pounds of credit card debt, uh, in order to afford me. So, apologies for that. <laughs> oh god, Chris, you can kill your stream now. <laughs> can I? I'm not allowed to. Oh, that was funny. Oh god. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna actually go. Oh, that was funny. It's, Joel Rock, you're my favorite. You're my favorite now. That was very funny. Thank you. Alright, anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. I would say get this thing because it's fun to drive. I would Please. rate it a solid 7 out of 10. Please subscribe. <laughs> no. Anyways, oh, thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys on the flip side. <laughs> Say goodnight. <laughs>
Bye bye. Bye. bye.